All right, y'all. Dumpster number one. The good old electrician's dumpster. Ah, there's a little bit of something up in here. Let's see. Got nothing too hot and happening, but I see some snippets. More boxes and such. Breakers, breakers. I guess I know, guys. There's silver in them breakers. Another meter socket. It's aluminum. Sometimes there's copper on there. No breaker box. No breakers in it, though. Nothing there. All right. Let's get some snippets. Get some snippets. Snippet time. Yeah, they toss out good snippets. Number one stuff. There's some just straight copper right there. Aluminum. More aluminum. Number one, right there. Anywho, how are we doing tonight, y'all? Everybody doing okay? Getting the summer kicked off. Everybody uh, being safe out there. Enjoying the first summer after COVID. Out and about, I can definitely tell the traffic is definitely back to Pre-pandemic levels. Copper right there. Everybody's itching to just get out. I hear you, man. I hear you. All right. COVID. COVID sucks. A little bit of copper. Right there. Right there. Right there. Right there. Getting about there. Toss that there. Quick little beginner here. A little cup of there, a little cup of there. I wish they would just kind of. Ooh, that's some good stuff. Just throw the crap in a box. Or put it in a bag and throw it in here. Let me go through it later, but it's what it is, right? Look at that though. Probably a couple bucks and number one wire right there. Right. Oops. All right. Yeah. Yeah, a little box of awesome stuff, man. Started off right. Right. All right, let's take a peek. I've been hitting this one for a few weeks now. There goes some stuff. Yeah, there is. All right, all right. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, what we'll do, back her on up. Shop. Up we go. Up and in, baby, up and in. Open tops. Oh. That stuff's got wires in it too. <sighs> oh, it's long. Good long. It's probably not the best, huh? It'll do though. It will work. Let's see. Let's see what we got here. Sheet rock. 
seat rack. Some corn. Am I hungry? Anyone? That's connected right there. This wire giving me a hard time. More working out. Different muscle group. Different muscle. Close the ups, man. here that's good wire too the good stuff more sheetrock have that wire there Two parts. <laughs> Been <to> both. <laughs> There's a big old pipe. I don't think we're bending that one. It's a negative on that. A bit bigger. Good scrap right here. I like open tops.
into the truck we go Oh, Rob, breaking a sweat. Way out of here. Whoa. Yeah. That's caught on some. Caught on some. Give it a good hard tug. See if she comes out. Not nah, it just. Uh. There it goes. Sometimes you just gotta give it a good tug. Woo, baby! Busting a sweat. Got all the pop. battery yeah these emergency exit signs they'll have a battery in it all right all right y'all look at all that Phew. That's just in one dumpster. Noise. What the hell? Cap Jack Sparrow up in here. Ooh, that one's like wood, I think. That's legit. You can smack somebody with that. Huh. I wonder if some kid's dad just said, enough is enough. Got tired of their kids beating up on their siblings with the hammer. That one's cool, that big one. It's like an old, uh, I don't know, cut you up kind of sword, huh? That's so weird, okay. Swords, swords and such. Quaker oats. <laughs> swords. Remember the time I found all the nunchucks? That one was pretty cool. 
Ah, some of them nunchucks were real too, like wooden, like totally mess you up. Sure. He's a three quarter. Little piece, three quarter. Some lights. Ooh, there's a sink down there. There's a down in the bottom. Uh oh. Trash man's gonna hate me for that one. Alright, let's see. Gotta dig it out. Sorry about that, guys. Alright. Pursuit of scrap. Oh, jeez. Get right there. But with all due actuality, there's a recycle dumpster literally right next door. Or right next to me. Probably should have just thrown it in there. But, oh well. Kept in the trash. All right, stainless sink. All right. Check it out. Hose in the dumpster. Hose in the dumpster. Ooh, look at that. Whoa, look at all those gears, man. Look at all of them. Oh, they're plastic. That one's not. Oh, man. Yeah. It's all plastic. That's no good. Got right here, y'all. Sprocket and Gear Incorporated. A catalog. With a bunch of sprockets. It's a cord. Oh man, I thought we hit something real good. Oh, there's some shelving in here. Yeah, those are all... Those are all plastic. Oh, there's a metal one. Some bearings. There's a little bit down here. Oh my god! That one's metal. There's some shelving down here on the bottom. Gonna have to dig it out. I'll just start tossing in the back here. Ugh. Way to go, Mike. So smooth. Is that hose? Yeah. So smooth. Gonna wake the dead. Right. So 
some more over here. Yeah, I never claimed to be the, uh, the smoothest dumpster driver. But I am a dumpster. And a scrap. And everything that comes with it. In between. Ooh, that hose is hard. I'll get the, uh, my little, not my little, the bolt cutters out. Cut those ends off there. Some more. Man, I thought we hit a lick on them, on those gears. Turns out not so much. Yeah, they're all plastic gears. I don't know, they may make some art. What do y'all think? Let's grab them. Let's grab them. Somebody might be interested. Because they are, they are kind of cool. You know, a little bit make a robot a robot let's get the shelf stuff here there's a metal one let's see here of interesting kind of cool something cool and modern I don't know what are these used for I guess if anything I mean punch the bearings out that's got bearings in there are metallic in nature right right boy and then police are out tonight man tell you what full force There's a metal one. The small ones look like like these like right here. That's a metal one. Almost could be used like as a dirt bike sprocket, huh? There's some, more. some metal ones in here. Gears and such. Then gear, then. Uh. All, right. All right. Yeah, baby. Oh, I got another one right there.
back in there. My mess over here. I really am an idioto. Idioto. Let me get my snips. All right, so I can't find my bolt cutters. Uh, just gonna take this home. Take this whole mess. I think I left my bolt cutters at the casa. Look at that piece of cat wire. Yeah, man, look at all that. Far out. Sprockets. Martin Sprocket. Yo, dumpster. Oh, we got it. Oh, you're rolling away on me. There's a, a boot box. What is this? It's taped together. It's link a spinner and tail as desired what there's a book Rieta Rieta legendary Texas cuisine and best summer drinks what there's a whole party right there a whole party speaking of party there's a card any money in the card Ah, no money, no money, no money. I like money, I like money. Oh yeah. All right. It's that big red one. Go a little some some. See the guy here. Uh. More hose. I can probably cut this piece off. Ooh, look at that. Cut that off. See the other end is. I see a bunch of metal poles. Right quick. Oh, and it's all bunched together too. Noise. I like it when it's like that. Piece of glass. Got a bunch of door hardware. That's good stuff too. That's always welcome in my truck. Those are big pieces. Big pieces. Oops. Right out the back. These I can't bend these. These are too thick. Those are really thick. Got here. That's pretty heavy. Oh, that's got some weight to it. Uh oh. Let's see here. I don't know if we'll be able to get that out. Let's see. Maybe. It's 
a lot of work for a little piece of scrap. Got it. And then there's another one. Down here. Okay, she's not too buried. Got it. All right. I gotta find the end of that hose. Emergency exit only. It's a piece of scrap. It's a piece of aluminum. It's a scrap there. There's a door opener. Right, hold on. Whoa! That looks like aluminum. Good stuff. Here, add a little piece of hose. All right, more lumber. Look at all that. Yeah. 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 And this big old thing. I don't know what that is. It's super heavy. Alright. See if we can find the end of this hose, huh? That's the end. Is that the end I cut? Nope. Alright, there's both the ends. We got one end. Someone cut the other end. Woo, yeah, hose! It's a little windy out here tonight, y'all. That's all plastic. All right. Rock and roll. Scrappity doo da, scrappity dad, baby. Yeah. That's plastic. Hose. Sweet! What we got here? Lights. Look at that. There's lights and wires and such up in here. Look at that. All right. Michael, take it. I'll take it. Why are there all kinds of stuff up in here, man? Rock and roll, baby. And it's got some wire attached to to Romex. We'll flip it. This one, the same story. Looks like it. Yes, sir. Lights and wires. Lights and wires. Light my fire. Light my fire. Scrappy doo about it. Whoa! Well, alrighty, scavengers, another successful trip out there on the books. Yeah, well, yeah, it was. Definitely got some good scrap. Good, good, good scrap. Good scrap, good scrap. Lots of metal pipes, metal stuff. Let me see some. 
That's not magnetic. That looks like, I guess, I guess, and that's going to be aluminum. The uh, screws and such are magnetic. So we're going to take that apart. Golly, and that thing is heavy too. I wonder what's inside. Oh, hold up. Let's see here. I don't know what that is, man, but it is definitely some good scrap to scrap, man. A few bucks right there. Uh, this hose over here. I actually was thinking, I was like, I need a piece of hose. So I could probably cut a piece of that off. Although that's a quarter inch. I think that's a little small. Uh, but yes, all in all, very successful evening out there. Getting some stuff. Got a little cleaning up to do. Got some stainless. Got some extruded aluminum over there. That's what that looks like. Uh, lots of metal pipe, wires. Uh, my little box of snippet my stuff over here i don't know why i grabbed this book all this stuff is available online the martin sprocket catalog uh, and you can't buy direct from market sprocket that's why there's a dxp card on there you got to go through a distributor like dxp but all this stuff basically this catalog right here is like this one that looks like shivs it's got the speed ratios ods number of uh uh like on the shivs number of uh belts it takes rpm or hp horsepower per belt yeah all the all the basic basically like if say you've got like a pump or something with a crankshaft and you need to figure out you know this is where the whole engineering thing comes in you know because you got your shaft and you got to figure out your shiv you know and um, how well your pumps gonna operate that kind of stuff I haven't done that kind of crap in a long time long long time I used to work back on pumps and such I uh, got all these uh, sprockets right here like I said like this one's metal good solid chunk of metal steel there went ahead and grabbed the plastic ones um, I mean there's nothing wrong with them I don't know what to do with them but I figured somebody may have some sort of idea to what to do with them i mean it's cool stuff what they call that steampunk but yeah we grabbed all of them so we'll see what happens there found some swords and some uh, uh texas cookbook and stuff like that but yeah i mean all in all i'm satisfied with our haul for the evening most deaf most deaf but anyways well, all right, scavengers, that's going to do it on this episode here of Dumpster Diving. I'm your host with the absolute most, Mike the Scavenger, but you already knew that. Uh, be sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel if you have it. Uh, please subscribe. Uh, I love subscribers. Subscribers are cool. Subscribers rock. Uh, Instagram, check it out. I got one if y'all want to get on there and see what other kind of crap I do, which isn't a lot. <laughs> uh, and then extra special shout out to everybody bought some merch definitely appreciate that guys if y'all are interested down below there should be a banner teespring go get y'all some stuff oh. ay, ay, ay. Uh, yeah but uh yeah got a little work to do this weekend uh we're getting up in the morning though uh we're heading to uh east bernard those of y'all are familiar with the h-town area east bernard's down there out by full sure which is on the uh, southwest end-ish out there. Uh, my wife, she's her family's uh, Czechoslovakian. That's a Granger part number. And uh, they're having a Czech fest out there tomorrow. So we're going to go check out the Czech fest. Get some kolaches. Uh, anybody from Texas, especially this part of Texas, Hill Country knows. Uh, lots of, lots of uh, Czechoslovakian influence. Lots of... Uh, Czechoslovakian uh, uh, settle, settle, settlement. I don't know the whole story on it, but yeah, there's lots of German and Czechoslovakian people that settled, you know, throughout the hill country and, you know, the central Texas and that kind of stuff. So, yeah, we're going to go check out the Czech Fest tomorrow. If y'all ain't got nothing going on, go check it out. Maybe we'll see each other. But until then, y'all stay tuned for that next one. Uh, yeah. Yeah. What we got here?